Hello, my fellow Shogun 2 players, as Rip would say. I'm here with Point Man. Finally! Majutsu! Hello. And we have someone who's invading our TS channel as well, Red. But Red's here? I'm who's not the invading? Host? Yes, you are. <laughs> I was well, being the host quiet. of this tournament. This is Red's 1v1 yeah, domination. Yeah, he's the host for show. He's, yeah. he's barely allowed to be here. He's By default, he's gone. Barely. I should have a no streaming rule for my matches. <laughs> <laughs> nah. Anyway, we are here on Osaka Plain. It's part of the group stages of. Uh, this called again? Yeah, Reds 1v1 Domination 2.0, Shogun 2 Tournament. This is the best of three between uh, Anarchy and Killerfish. Yes, Killerfish. Haven't seen him play Shogun 2 in a while, so. Oh, it was in that flex turn yeah. we entered uh, nice. last weekend, and we both failed! Yay! <laughs> I'm the one that faced him. I think. Oh, in the last tournament I participated in. Ah. Faced Killerfish. Here we go! So, uh, you guys can go over their armies if you want. Maju, you can start with Anarchies, I guess? Okay, uh, yes. And a key, he has a level 6 Master Kashigaru running towards the river. Uh, then he has two Yari Sams behind it. One vanilla, well, both vanilla. Uh, for his calf force, a melee gen. Uh, Yari calf vanilla, Yari calf vanilla, and bow calf level 8. That's pretty insane. Then he has another free calf units. Uh, Yari calf vanilla, level 6 Yari calf, and level 9 Yari calf at Bonsai. Then he has another matchlock. Ashigaru level 6 with rank by fire also it seems. Uh, Yari Sam level 7 minded. Magic Warrior Monk level 6 also fire by rank. And the, another Yari Sam level 7. So, um, skirmish and calf it seems. Yeah. Killerfish's build, he has 4 matchlock units and he has one of each kind of matchlock too. Matchlock Monk, matchlock uh, Portuguese Terso, matchlock Ashigaru, matchlock Samurai. He has three Yuri Cav, one Fire Cav, two Light Cav, and three Naginata Tenants, and that is it. And a Bojan. Yeah, like so. We this both players are not focusing on melee infantry at all. Yeah, but I think I prefer Killerfish here because he's got. I guess he has the Bojan, and I would favor the Bojan oh. over the melee gen since. You can snipe uh, the melee gen with your bow gen while keeping your distance. But Anarchy has it's... Ned Stark as his general. He's a Stark. Mm. But uh, that shouldn't have gonna die, die though. Something left. Yeah. Spoiler alert, he's gonna die then. <laughs> to those of you who haven't watched the series. You shouldn't just spoiled fish it. have Why more left? Say... Is this everything he has? Hmm. I doubt it. I think he has something in the forest there. Since this or is maybe a ninjas, game, Wacos. this is pretty much an opponent to the war, so I feel like the shrine is actually going to be more beneficial. Yeah, well, farmhouse is going to be important too, I guess, for them to uh, to around. catch that that bojan. The bojan might be a little bit uh, annoying with the extra speed, because I already know it has a speed retainer on it. So he killed one guy with the bowcap so far. It was one of the general units. Yeah, that's but... not so much. Yeah, okay. exactly. These are weird builds. Well, I like Anarchy's build. Well, that's a Yeri Samurai, but it's not really Rush. Yeah. If Anarchy would have brought a Rush build I think... against Fish here and then used the farmhouse and other speed boosting retainers, he could have outflanked him uh, and I think rushed him, yeah. I think it's that can be done. gonna be so annoying. Yeah, their builds are tailored to the map, though, I suppose, because you see that there. Are... Well, Anarchy didn't have a clue about the map. He asked uh, Red for information about the map, so he didn't plan this ahead of time. Yeah. And look, Fish is gonna try and get the farmhouse, and their Anarchy is gonna be able to deny it for a bit, but then the Bojan is gonna start doing the damage. I knew this was going to happen. I mean, when you play the slow game against Killerfish, let him do his thing, pick you apart, you're not going to beat him. That's why I always rush against him. I don't yeah, like wasting time. Too. Like, when I tried going for like a pike box against the uh, Killerfish, it failed horribly. <laughs> because he, he just 
he just played it out so well. But when I went for rushes against Skitterfish, it usually ends up going fine. Yeah. Like, that's my best chance, too. Same. I mean, I I don't like these slow situations, either. I mean, this is like Napoleon to the war right now. All these guns yeah. and shooting back and forth. Yeah, look. Bokev is getting some kills, though. Match against Garo. It's like... The match, it's like Rome 2 right now. We have the matchlocks as javelins and the bojan as slingers or something. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I compare this more to no point to the war. Yeah. We're full of samurai, actually. Ooh, nice volley on the boat cab. Oh, Yari cab, rather. Yep. Nine losses so far. Bokev gets in but... range of the gen. If only one of them just took a rush build, then the one that took the skirmish build would be like on their knees right now. Exactly. Anarchy is just trying to deny that farmhouse, and there's nothing really he could do. He's just going to be pelted by the Bokev. What is Anarchy doing with his Bokev? He's not shooting at all, is he? I think he turned all fire at will. He's getting outplayed here. Like. The only thing that's good for him, I guess, is that k there is no archery dojo on the map, so Killerfish can't... Uh... Maybe he's trying to waste his ammo, I don't yeah. know. Yeah, but then don't use your bow cam, that is level 8. True. Yeah. He could use his Yari Samurai, put it in loose formation, then try and... Yeah, actually, like, he could move up with the bow cam, but using the Yari uh, Samurai uh, as support. BP Sam. Oh, look Was at that Was that there before? Cap. Oh. But look at the Yari Cav. It's gonna take damage. The Bojan. Now it's showing This must be back. so frustrating. I mean, he's losing Cav. What he could do is move two of his Yari Sams um, all the way to the right flank. Well, the BP-7 can stop to the air sense, but he can get one of the higher level ones, level uh, 7. That should be able to do fine. Oh. He's running away, yeah, just in time before the matchups can get a shot. Now Killerfish is going to do his own little attack, since he knows his opponent isn't going to be doing anything. He's going to try and overwhelm that one flank, but he's not going to be able to catch it. Uh, Anarchy nope. is moving in towards the general. Because there is no cover now. Well, one uh, cav unit here, Yari Cav. Oh, he decides to pull back, but he's still gonna lose so much of that unit. And we might have an engagement soon, actually. Yeah. Unless. Nah, Kirkus I should don't stop, think though. so. He should stop chasing. Yeah, yeah, there we go. He needs support. General has 71 kills. But uh, how many volleys will he be able to but to it's, get? It's starting to get pretty effective though, that general. It's done quite a bit of damage to those matchlocks, killed a lot of those Yari Cav. Bojan, super effective. <laughs> yeah, it looks like... Oh, I like the names of the units. Uh, bullet Not a Yari the Sam. Yeah, and Not a Yari Sam for the fish moving out of the back. Bullet yeah. to the Neil. We have Samurai. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, I'm getting shot. Riders Rohan. <laughs> Ooh, that Bokav. Bokav is, is gone. I'm Arrow say. to the knee. 20 men left. No, it's still not routed yet, but it's useless. I don't know, like, Killerfish has got this flank because of that bulletproof Samurai. And his I wish cap. Killerfish named his units. I don't name my units either. <laughs> you're a horrible person. Well, the thing is, if you name your units, your opponent can more easily see that they're veterans. Not that it really matters though, Our but... hidden units have been discovered, my lord! <laughs> Still, they should be titled. Like the Yolo squads. Oh, oh, he's gonna cab. lose a light cap here. Yeah, some micro it's only mistakes. a light cap. Good for pinning. Yeah, th this is a decent move by, uh, by Anarchy. He should now move back his calf, so the Yari Sam can just take this, the calf hit here. Uh, 
Oh, he could have charged with his melee gen, but what yeah. is he doing? I think, like, his melee gen, he should have used his own calf to pin the calf of Killerfish and then used his melee gen to kill the bulletproof, maybe. Yeah. But now he didn't really get a charge off and is losing men. Yeah, this. This, this might not this go so not, for. It's not good. For anarchy, yeah. I wouldn't charge him to a BB Sam anyway. Yeah. He has to commit now, the, like the rest of his forces. But that Yari Sam is coming, but I feel like that it might be a little bit late, late to the party. It's actually Anarchy is it. moving out his general, but it will get charged by this fire calf, which do a lot of damage. Ooh, wow. He won the calf fight. Yeah, uh, managed and down to 13 men after that charge. He could go for that matchlock potentially. I don't know if he... No, he could use that free calf unit, the Yari calf, to kill the matchlock Shigaru and maybe get the, the general, but... Yeah. His gen is dying. Look, eight men. That's Seven, fire is five, four. It. Ooh. Look, there's an engagement in the middle as well. Our general has been injured, my lord. General, I think he's there. just trying to bait oh, him into the match. The far line. left, Anarchy is moving a Yari Cav, and he's gonna charge the the match lock. It seems, but he's gonna get ch counter charged by no. Light Cav. Actually, that wasn't. He meant, like his Cav didn't get a charge on the Light Cav. Because Banzai Yari Cav already using the Banzai. Yeah. Yep. And Look at the center. He's gonna try and bait the Cav into his matchlocks. But the thing is, he's pretty much already lost this game. So. Yeah, with no gen. Well, he does have the shrine, well, but he doesn't have the cavalry. Yari Cav is gonna to... go into that matchlock summary by the workshop. The uh, it's gonna try. Dying. Yeah. Can't... Oh no, he's gonna <laughs> run away. That, that Fish has four le matchlocks left and the bow gen, and he has the farmhouse. So he can kite all he wants. Yeah, and it's just. And while Anarchy does have a lot of match locks, it's just. A lot of them are quite damaged. So they will not be able to do too much, I Just feel. doing these slow games against Killer Fist is just. You're gonna frustrate your own self. Oh, look, he could uh, get some volleys off with that match lock Warrior Monk. Cat, uh, Killer Fish did. That is, I almost called them cattlefish. Cattlefish. <laughs> cattlefish. I swung them back. And fish has calf on the flanks now. He's gonna, he has uh, cattle calf. He's gonna corner <laughs> this Machikashigaru. Bo calf died. Cattle bo calf. <laughs> Matchlock, yeah, as you said, it's gonna die here most likely. Yeah, he's gonna. Isolate well, Anarchy is sending his last full Yari Cav. Yeah. Thing is though, that matchlock Ashigaru is outranged by the monk, so now Killerfish is just gonna move in and try and do some damage. But the line of sight is not so good here. Let's see. Oh, here comes Killerfish. And that volley was against uh, BP Sam, did nothing. Yeah, like, he has no units that can kill that BP Sam over there. Actually, he, uh, he has, he has the two Yari that Sams that can do <laughs> fine against it, but, yeah, not win. Yeah, and look, look at Killerfish's BP Sam, it's bugging out while it's trying to chase. It keeps falling over. <laughs> <laughs> well, they're the wearing some heavy too, armor. Uh, too heavy, yeah. No, it happens on any unit, it's just an annoying bug in the game. So, Fish hey, getting a charge gen, off on this depleted so Yari Cav. That will uh, route now. It looks like he's gonna pull his... Is, is he gonna move on towards the match source or is he gonna pull back behind his uh, spears? From the this, oh, Fish this is, is sacrificing go, his Cav here. Yeah, he's not, that's not gonna go so well for Fish. Because he's losing the camp there, and he's gonna lose that Naginata Tendon too, so that was... Well, he still has enough. Uh, yeah. Fish is gonna... Yeah, micro mistake, he's moving into a Yari Sam with his light cap. Yeah, but it doesn't Next really to the shrine. at this point. Like, he still no, it's them. not matter, but it's sloppy. Oh, he's he's a sloppy move again with his Yari Cav. No counter charge against that Yari Cav of Anarchy. Y you can see if you just put a lot of pressure on him, and that <laughs> if he needs to make a lot of moves like this, he will make mistakes. Mm, yeah, 
just made a few micro mistakes in a lot of places. And his match oh, samurai is gonna get killed by this match like Warrior Monk. But still, this is not. Our men no. are running like at this point. No. Yeah. It's match just like a show, aim it to the gen. It's decided, but you didn't need to lose some of these units. But yeah. it's fine. Fish needs to grow in this tournament. It's this, needs to get better slowly. Yeah, it's this bulletproof samurai that's really killing him right now. Like he may yeah, have Yeah, Fish is good, he just doesn't play the game that much. He's playing uh, Counter-Strike Global Offensive a lot yeah. more. Well, yeah, you can see that if you don't practice, then you make mistakes like these. Yeah. At least Our play another RTS game. It's common. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Anarchy is trying to kite with free match locks. Oh, is Yari but uh, uh, it's not gonna work. Yari Cap dead here. And I think he gave up. Yep. I'll face kill the fish for him. Just rush. That's all you gotta do. <laughs> don't even think about it. That's what I told him. Just don't even think when you plan. Just do it. Here they go. He actually but has weird run. builds to counter a uh, Bojan. Yeah. I mean, he doesn't actually have anything to contest the Bojan. Even though he yeah. has that vocab, it's still not enough. The matchlocks aren't a bad idea in, on this map, but against the Bojan, I would have taken a lot more cav. I would have yellowed it and rushed. <laughs> yep, yellow. Yellow all the way. Of course you would have. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like more Cav anyway, because he had a bunch of spears. Oh, on an unrelated note, looks like Zeru posted the new video. Rome 2 online battles 44 to 45. C, Z, snap. <laughs> okay. You're so... promoting Rome 2 in my stream? What? Well, I'm promoting the ripped. That's a different Burn story. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> it's it's a different story. <laughs> GG! Oh. How many more games? Uh, uh, at least one? Yeah. Maybe two. So, yeah, I'll see you in game number two. It's game number two between Killerfish and Anarchy. This time we are on Gunma Field. Oh, what's going on here? They're gonna restart. restart. Oh. Restart again? Okay. Well, this is gonna make for an epic battle since it's on Ultra. <laughs> yep. Well, if, uh, okay, Yay. they're gonna play. So it's gonna be an epic. Doesn't really battle. matter. Gonna lag a bit though. <laughs> well, it's one v one. It should be fine. I hope. I don't sense any lag so far, but so I mean, cross my fingers. Thing is, we've still got melee gen for anarchy. What general did Killerfish have actually? I didn't check. I did not check because I was kicked out before I could watch. Red? Do you know? Um. Uh, I'm gonna guess it's a Bojan. Yeah, that's my guess. I think he probably changed though. Yeah. If if I need to guess, it's a combined think... melee bow. Yeah, like Killerfish does never plays the same gen twice in a row, or at least he doesn't usually do that. I think. And on this map, it's better to have combined gen, I would say, than yeah. just a Fish. pure Bojan. He never uses the same retainer <laughs> in a row either. He does. <laughs> Here we go. So. I'm gonna go over Anarchy's build. He's got the melee gen again. Then we've got Yari Cav, rank six, to the left of his gen. Yari Cav rank seven. Wow, and seems like uh, two more Yari Cav to the right of it. One vanilla and one rank six. Uh, for the rest of his units, though, he's got well, I can say no match locks, no bows, no skirmishing Our units at all. Units seems like it's a pure rush. We have a walk raider that was just. Uh, Spotted over there, and then we have one, two, three, four, five Naginata attendants, and then a lot of uh, katanas and no dachis, it seems here. And we have lag. No, yeah, it looked like it was fine for the longest yeah. time. I think someone's it's dropping. It's red, it's you. <laughs> no, I don't know who it is. So, this is a katana <laughs> rank. So accusatory. Nine. 
Oh, it's Banzai Katanas, I think. Because they're ranked. No, 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 they weren't Banzai. Sure. Oh, wait. There's no Banzai. They were Banzai. Just... Wait, then that's so useless to have them at level 9. <laughs> yeah. At least I like his Waco like Raider name. You get them as scare enemies, don't you? Uh, uh actually. But... That's still but weird, yet, though. Uh, he had, uh, Yari, Banzai Yari Calf before. Oh, it's Maju. We shouldn't have. It was you, Maju. No! Somehow. <laughs> Damn this. Well, I just wanna Red, further, go stream, uh, point okay. out whose stream is uh, superior. Radio broadcast <laughs> then. <What? Maybe. laughs> the stream is still fine. Okay, so but I'm just not moving. Yeah, it is get a fish with the combined the general now. Yeah. And it changes general. And we're looking at the melee core. Look at that overextension by the Yari Cav. Oh, taking oh, no. so much damage. Losing didn't even get a charge 20 off. men. Yeah, he lost 20 men for free there. And, and he's losing yeah, more. 50 foes. out of 80. And he stopped, so he's gonna take more damage again. There is an isolated light cap of fish in the back, though, being chased by one of Anarchy's highly yeah. upgraded Yari Cav. But. That was a waste, though, but Anarchy realizes it. Like, if he. If that light cap keeps away that Yari cap for like the whole game, it's already paid for itself. Basically, but it's not what's happening here. And you can see Fish is trying to push for the farmhouse. Like he's not even worrying about the workshop here. For now at least. But he certainly should send the unit to grab like the farmhouse at least. Because it seems like Anarchy is not contesting it. There we go, light cap gonna I, cap it. Yeah, I think he's gonna uh, dismount that light cap. So yeah, probably with the rest he's gonna try and deny the workshop or do some damage. His gen is gonna do damage though here, but it's again it's not the full bow gen, so it's not gonna be as effective, but it's still gonna do a lot. Still I think for Anarchy doing damage. Uh he just needs to tie down like Fish's uh body of infantry near his gen in those Tiari Cav yeah. on Fish's left flank. Oh, fish, be careful with your general. He's going straight into spears. Oh, it's a melee gen. Doesn't really it's matter. It's a melee gen. <laughs> yeah, I forgot. Like, and it's. I see arrows going in, and I think it's bow gen, but then I forget that it has a combined gen. And here comes the katana cav from anarchy. Yeah, he actually this lost unit, the man. To a that standard. katana cav. <laughs> uh, if he gets that into fish's gen or the swords, oh. going to bunch on them. This looks really bad attack. for Anarchy. Like, this is so blubbed up here. Oh. Anarchy is going in on the gen, though. And watch Fissy's gen just drop uh, instantly about 10 men already. But there is a Naginata attendant to support there, so. I, I actually think this engagement. I don't think it's that bad for Anarchy once he got past the blob. No, but he could have done way better, though. This engagement. Like Definitely. It was certainly not. Uh, but yeah, we can see that Fish is having some issues here. His bow monks are doing almost nothing either. It's just Jen is wavering. Yeah, it actually uh, looks quite bad for Fish now. <laughs> and I don't like think he's gonna get. Oh, he, he got the bonsai off. But that katana cab. Going to town on Fish's Jen, which I believe has routed off the field. Uh. And even though Anarchy is really blobbed in, in the center here, he's still he's doing really well. Uh, he's beating off Fish's yeah. Cav on the left flank. But so many mistakes though on both players' ends already. Look, Fish yeah. forgot that Yari Sam as well. I think uh, Fish flank. is in, in a lot of trouble. Yeah, he's gonna GG I don't think here. he can come back. He can see his defeat, so... It looks like uh, we have a uh, 1-1 scenario here. Very interesting. I would that say probably a, my favorite yeah. part about Fish. When so he knows the game's over, he concedes. Yeah. Doesn't make everyone watch. But, well, that's also a weakness, because you can come back from being down in the game. He actually conceded, or did he just say GG? He said GG and conceded immediately defeat. conceded after. Uh -huh. I don't well, see how Fish could have come back from that. But there was still, like, a small chance. But, yeah. Like, you can, when you, you could actually say GG, and then keep playing, and your opponent thinks he's won, and he's gonna make yeah. mistakes. Yeah, well, I, then... I, you should have a rule, <laughs> if you say GG, it's over. You can't come back. 
Oh, that's. But well, I don't know. That would to be win with gun calf. What? Now what GG is... is like saying I lost. Good game. And then if if your opponent has, to, yeah, you can start stop doing anything, and then you can still win. Yes. That's lame. Could be meaning go go instead of good game. No, no, no. Just, you know, just saying. Just saying. It could be a typo. It could be many things. Right. There could be a lot of stuff. GG's for. Yeah. yeah, I know. <laughs> it could also mean good guy, you know? Well, look at that exactly. GG! Look at that GG, and then he means great guard. Or, or great guard. <laughs> or good gun. Yeah. Uh, yeah. is the... Are you guys back in the lobby? Because I can't join. Right, I'm back in the lobby. See you in game three. That's I don't like your idea. Hello and welcome to game number three of Anarchy against Killerfish. So here we shall see what's gonna happen here. We are on Sug River. So we have Shrine, Workshop, and Farmhouse. Again, this is a replay cast as uh, was not there for the third game. But uh, as you can see here, we have Anarchy sending in some Mayari Cav to meet up with Killerfishes. I can't really go over the builds, but as you can see, Anarchy does have a mix of uh, Swords, spears, and the contingent of matchlocks as well. So we already have, of course, Killerfish has the melee bow general, while uh, Anarchy has. Uh, oh, he's actually he actually has two flanks here that are not doing anything for him right now. But here, disengagement. Uh, I guess this great guard is going to die without doing too much. It's not going to be cost effective for. Uh, Anarchy, because the, this these two Yari Cav units are just killing it right now, and as you can see, down to 23. Especially with some bow calf support, gonna be able to get rid of that uh, those units there. And here come uh, Anarchy's units here. They're gonna be supporting, or so this uh, Great Guard is getting charged by Killerfish, so it's gonna lose some men now. That scheme is uh, getting really crazy right now. Oh, Anarchy is getting some nice shots into Killerfish's uh, Yari Cap here. Over Killerfish is gonna pull his Yari Cap back. Some volleys from Bow Cav, but Killerfish actually lost a lot of Cav here. So did Anarchy, of course, and especially as he lost Great Guards. Comes another engagement though. This one should be good for Killerfish, but until the Naginata attendants come into support, that is. So after that, it's gonna become uh, harder for him to engage there. He engaged prematurely here, actually, because he should have waited for uh, more units. But here comes a uh, Yari Cav of Anarchy. And try and get to the match docks of Killerfish, but they fail, so he's gonna have to get them out of there. But unfortunately, now f for him, those Yari Cav actually took a lot of losses as they were pulling out. They got stuck a little bit in spears. These Nadachis here not really able to do too much, especially as there are match docks there. I mean, the game isn't over yet, but y you can see that Killerfish has a slight advantage here. And his general is uh, is doing some good work, even though it's only using his bow right now. He's doing pretty well for himself. Hmm. And actually, here comes uh, a camp charge from Anarchy. Which, by the way, I'm not sure. I don't think you can call him Anarchy, but just that his name is... Uh, I can't pronounce his name, that's why I call him Anarchy. And here his matchlock is uh, dying. It's a matchlock Ashiar though, it probably had an attack order on the matchlock warrior monks. Still in the fight though, but the Snodachi is gonna route, and there it goes. He may have used his Banzai. He did get his uh, Nodachi's charged by the general of Killerfish. Not sure what Killerfish's general is doing there, because he's gonna start losing men. But yeah, at this point, this is uh, Killerfish's game to lose. To nice calf charge here, though, into the matchlock samurai of Killerfish by Anarchy, but he should get away from there right now. Because he's getting charged by Noda Cheese, and yeah, he doesn't. He shouldn't stay in that fight, especially with Bo Cav supporting, and the potential of Killerfish's gen also coming in to support. Would mean Anarchy's general would die, which would not be very good at all. 
But yeah, he's actually making something happen here, but there are just way too many units for Killerfish left, I feel. But it is close, it is close, especially as he's uh, trying all he can to get rid of this Nodachi here, but... Yeah, uh, he did uh, give up the first volley here. These two units should be routed. Our matchlock is routed without even getting a single volley. Nice flanking shots on the Bojen, uh, or rather melee gen of Killerfish, I suppose. But this Bokev just is doing a number on Killerfish's, on uh, Anarchy's general. And now he's gonna take the take the charge with Bokev and then go in with his Avatar's bodyguard. Didn't go as well as he had hoped for though. So now I, I suppose he might come back with the Bokev and start doing damage to Anarchy's general. But I mean, Anarchy's general is winning until there's support for it. Then it should change. Of course, Anarchy should pull back here with his uh, match like Ashigaru, uh, though it did get routed. So it's pretty much game right now. I mean, these two units here running away, but I don't, I don't see him uh, being able to a victory out of this and even his general is gonna die anyway and that's his last tool that he has besides that bokeh but not enough units left for anarchy but he was doing some good moves in the game but as you can see Killerfish was just able to out strategize him good game from both players though and Killerfish does end up taking this uh, two to one Nice series overall, but yeah, I'm still waiting for this last unit to route, and there it goes, and this should be game. So yeah, uh, we shall see if I actually get to see the statistics screen or not. But anyway, uh, Gitterfish should be able to advance without much of an issue through the group stage here. I believe he is first in the group let's take a look at the kills yeah look at killer fish's kills with bp samurai i can actually see those units like where they actually were fighting but of course the avatar's bodyguard and the bokev expected great cards for anarchy not sure but they might have paid for themselves as they killed a lot of yari cav but anyway Hope you guys and girls enjoyed. If you want to see more, don't forget to comment and subscribe. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Google+. Share the video, and I'll see you next time.